Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. As you guys have seen by the title of today's video, I will be giving you all an updated room tour. Honestly, I am super excited to show you my new bedroom because I have actually treated myself to a few new pieces of furniture and I know that you guys will absolutely love everything in my room. I'm hoping anyway because, yeah, I have spent a little bit of dollar um, prepping my room up and making it perfect to my taste because, as you guys probably know, I love my pink and gold at the minute and I did kind of treat myself to something which is around here somewhere but you will have to wait until the middle of the video to find out the boy it is, but yeah, um, yeah, I don't know, I don't know what I was going to say really, but before we get into this video, please make sure to leave a thumbs up, I want to get to a goal of 50 likes on the video, so please make sure to leave a thumbs up, a comment down below, and please also subscribe to my channel because I would absolutely love to hit 5,000 subscribers, so please subscribe to my channel, but without further ado, Let's go on the room tour. So starting off with my room tour, the most boring part as well um, is my door. I have a dressing gown for PLT and my onesie as well on this door. And on either side of this, I have my cupboard door. I just have a sign in it which will say, happiness is a journey. And not a destination. So it's that, and I've had these two doors in my room ever since I moved in here. And I know cupboards actually storage for jackets, shoes, shoe boxes, suitcases. It basically is the family's storage area for bags and shoes and suitcases and everything. So it's that part of my room. Really pretty boring, but I just wanted to get it over and done with pretty much. And slowly moving on to this part of my room. On my wall, as you guys can see, I have this absolutely stunning print from the brand Mappyfull because they kindly sent me over a print of my choice and oh my god, their prints are amazing quality. Let's choose a frame to go with them as well on the side if you really want to. I did decide to choose a gold frame because I love my gold interior at the minute and I did get a map of the stars. Mappyfull is the brand where you can make your own personalised prints using their templates on their website and will print them to the nearest printing place to reduce carbon emissions by 67% like what the hell 67% reduced carbon emissions and like how good is that on the environment and also helps the climate change as well so if you guys would like to get yourself a print from Mappyfull it will be helping the environment as well. When it's arrived, I was absolutely shocked because the quality overall is amazing. The print was in perfect condition. I did get a map of the stars because it shows you what the stars were like um, at the time. When my boyfriend asked me out to be his girlfriend, so um, Keswick was actually the place where he asked me out. So I put a Keswick on there. The day we got together, 4th of July, and it just had the north and west of like the of the earth and everything on there but they do prints such as horoscopes, stars, the photos of you and your friends and family into cartoons and all sorts and there's so many more to choose from so if you guys would like to grab yourself a print and a frame to go up in your room you click the link in the description of this video and you check the website out because they are so friendly as well like the people who work in Apple are they're some of the friendliest people I've ever worked with. So I highly recommend making an order from there. It'll give your room kind of like a bit of a Scandinavian theme to it as well, which I absolutely love. So thank you very much, Papa Fall, for sending me this gorgeous print. I cannot wait to keep this up in my room. And oh my God, it fits so perfectly as well. So thank you very much, guys. So next up in my room, I actually have my white, gorgeous Ikea chest of drawers, as you guys can see. And on here... I do have a lot of candles because, guys, I am absolutely obsessed with my candles. Like, I have a Palm of Violets one, which is amazing. I think I actually bought this from B&M for, like, a few pounds. Oh, my God, it's so good. I do actually have this lovely plant from Ikea in the gold plant pot because, as you guys know, I love my gold interior and plant pots and everything. I do have a wax burner from B&M, I think, as well. And 
I do actually have a love heart the box melt here and it smells so nice of strawberries and next up I do have a print of me in scotch it's actually from LWS personal touch so head over to get your personalised print off them I have another candle because you've got to never have too many candles and then I actually have this gorgeous gold tray from b for £6 it's absolutely stunning and on here it just has an Ikea lantern it's got this one tea light hold which is actually from Primark it's so pretty and I'm a favourite ever Yankee candle in the world sugared blossom which smells of like alien perfume and if you guys have never smelled the alien perfume smell it because it's absolutely gorgeous but, but here is what is on top of my the drawers and inside I just have like PJs and hoodies pretty much really boring but yeah it's just the basic kind of things where I store all my PJs and comfy clothes pretty much so these drawers are actually really spacious and the IKEA furniture is really good quality so like I recommend if you want to get yourself some furniture go to IKEA because like it's really good quality and lasts a very long time as well next up in my room I actually have the most beautiful chair ever it is the Vivian cocktail chair from Dunnell um, it's like a pink velvety material and gold legs on there as well which I love and I actually bought this for £149 from Dunnell and oh my god I am absolutely obsessed with it I did actually buy another piece of furniture to match it but keep on watching the video to find out what the other piece of furniture is and that and on this chair I do have a lovely throw from Primark which is gorgeous I do actually have my um, a cushion from Primark and also another cushion from Primark basically everything it's on Primark on the chair pretty much but um, yeah, this cushion actually makes the chair look really pretty um, and it matches well with the chair as well and please ignore all the mess around here I have my tripod there and then my um, like other bits and bobs where I don't know where to put it but yeah and then and then moving on to my wardrobe this is my wardrobe it's actually from Ikea and I've had this for years um, ever since I really did my room like it's it's so spacious so in this side it has the rail on it and inside it has a mirror hello everybody I keep all of my like designer boxes and bags and stuff um, and everything like that but yeah now, this wardrobe is really spacious so like it actually has a rail of clothes and underneath it has a little shelf to store the things underneath now, it has four or five shelves in here just like to store like all the bits and bobs but yeah I love this wardrobe a lot and if you're looking for like a good spacious wardrobe I recommend this one because like it is really really spacious and next up on my room tour I have my lovely bed but before we get onto my bed I do actually have a new piece of furniture to show you all so this may look very familiar um, it's basically the same as the chair but I actually bought it's ottoman from Home Bargains it is pink velvet the one with gold a leg and this is £50 by the way and it's so good I've actually been looking for an ottoman for absolutely ages in this design um, I was really overpriced online and then I went to Home Bargains a couple of days ago and I found this for 50 quid so I was like right I'm going to get it it looks really expensive it's 50 quid here's a bargain for what it is so I decided to get it and inside here, I'll leave your guesses down below of what you think is inside the ottoman. Three, two, one. You ready? Of course I had to store all of my designer things in here. So like, I have my Dior sandals in here which I haven't actually worn yet but they're absolutely stunning. I have a couple of Dior handbags in here. I have a Valentino bag, a Louis Vuitton bag. The Gucci bag and the Louis Vuitton bag and also the pouch as well but it is really handy for storing all my designer items in here and I love it There's so much it looks really pretty on the end of my bed as well so that is what is inside the ottoman and it's a bargain so I recommend if you go to home bargains have a look at this because it's amazing I love it so much I'm moving swiftly onto my bed and my bed is actually from Ikea again pretty much all my furniture is from Ikea and it actually has four drawers underneath it for storing the things in oh ignore the phone call but on my bed as you guys can tell 
I have my gorgeous bedroom from IKEA. Um, I've had this bedroom for probably I think I've had this bedroom for probably three years now. But oh my god, like the quality is amazing. It doesn't afraid or anything. Um, it's super soft. The two floors are from Primark. I've had this one for years. I've also had this one for years, but the match with my bedroom. So why not keep them? And then I think all my cushions are from Primark apart from two things from Primark, 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 Primark again. And these two are from BM. Eight pounds each. These cushions are actually part of the rush range in BM and Oh my god, the quality is amazing. So £8 each for those two. And yeah, this is my bed. In case you're wondering, the wallpaper is from the range. Um, I love it. There's so much matches in my room, pink and green. Um, I do have a lot of plants in here, so that's why I like the green on my wall as well. But yeah, here's my bed. And oh my god, it's so spacious and has a lot of storage underneath. And again, it's from Ikea as well, so that's my bed. Moving swiftly onto my bedside table, it's from Ikea again, because Ikea does provide some really good furniture. Um, I have my pink velvet lamp from B&M, a Summer Glory hand food, my Bluetooth speaker from Amazon, I've had for years again, oh my god. It's amazing for taking with you, if you want to have like a little sing-song in the shower. I have my Google Home Mini or something, and it's really good for playing music, like the sound quality is amazing. I have my jewel candle, I prime my candle, the fake flowers in a little jar, I have my drink on here as well which I should have moved before I actually filmed the video but I do have two coasters, I have an A coaster and an S coaster for Alice and Scott. Um, I do actually have this gorgeous tea light holder from Home Bargain to 169 it's pink with gold and I do, I do this in all sorts of colours. I have some photos with me and my sister. And then a very empty sweet jar behind there, but I will have to fill it up again. And then inside here, I just have, well, it's actually a tip at the minute, so I apologise in advance. I just have uh, my hair brushes, I have my pill box because I'm on the worst pill ever known to man at the minute. <laughs> like sweets, I just have like a lot of sweets in there, face masks, scrunchies as well, but that's in that one. And then moving down again, oh my god, ignore all the wires, this is the reality of my room, okay, yes, it is messy, and then in here, I have um, like a, a lot of notebooks, I've got some blues in there, highlighters, a weekly gold list as well, which is actually from Cherries, if you guys have not watched my Cherries haul, you need to watch it, and it, yes, that is my the bedside table, and it's really good for storing the rubbish in there, pretty much. <laughs> and moving on to this corner of my room, I have my drawers. I've had these ever since I was a kid. And it's the odd one out of home furniture, because, like, home furniture is white. And this is brown. But it's been a long-lasting soldier in my bedroom. And it basically stores, like, electronics in there. Like socks and knickers and like and all sorts and bikinis and all sorts in there. And on top of here, I have some fake flowers from IKEA and a milk bottle, a Yankee candle in in cherry and vanilla. It smells amazing. A be kind sign from Primark, a candle, and a pineapple money box as well because I like to keep all my coins in there. Above here, I have my clock from IKEA and then a photo of the me and Scott in there. I'm going to show you, there it is, how cute is that, but yeah, yeah that is in my draw area. Then moving on to my windowsill obviously, I do not want to show off my address where I live, but I just have a lot of cactuses on here, I have a little house for them, Um, ignore like all the things on there, yes, this is the reality of what my room is like every day and I don't I really want to fake it to you all and then I have my hairy cactus on here I actually call this a Larry, I don't know why I call it a Larry but yeah <laughs> there's Larry for you and then also have oh my god it's so awkward on the windowsill because I don't want to give anything away 
I have another candle, which I've had for years, but it smells amazing. Will that focus? I don't know if it will focus. Focus on me. But, but, focus on me. Come on then. Focus. Okay, but it isn't focusing, but yeah. And then, I, I do have a dead rose plant on there, but I will make it survive again. A jewel candle. And then, further along here, I have... All my cactuses and everything, and they're actually flowering at the minute as well, which is really cool to see. Yeah, but that's the windowsill basically. And next up, I just have a little storage unit, IKEA again. I've had a bit of leakage in that one, so it's taken all the steel on there, but that's that pretty much. And then on here, I have a lot of candles. I have a tea light hold a fake plant, a jewelry kind of trinket area, some cute bags. Uh, what's this called? I don't have a clue what it's called. I'm trying to find a fake flower to put in here, but I don't know what kind to go for. I have my mirror. I have my money kind of like a uh, holder thing. I have my little trinket again. And the Ikea of another three week candle because, like, oh my god, the Ikea candles can't just say they are amazing. And then above here, I have my shelf, which I love a lot. Like, I love this shelf. There's so much help from Ikea and. Um, I do actually have a canvas. Me and Scotty actually got this for Christmas, I think. Oh, oh my God, I love this photo of us too so much. All dressed up before lockdown and everything. But here, I have my fake IKEA rose vine. I love this a lot and it looks really pretty in my room. I have my 18, I like to up bottle off my friend for my 18th birthday. I can't believe I was 18 like a year and a half ago. It's crazy. Um, I have some candles, fake cactuses. I've got a love heart kind of like a decoration, some more candles, another tea light holder, a fake plant and more candles because I love my candles and fake plants. But yeah, now that is my shelf and I love it a lot. And then also on here, I just have photos of makeup on here. And that is that pretty much. The next up I have my gorgeous dressing table again. Have a guess where this is from. You ready? Ikea. <laughs> because Ikea, as I said, they do some amazing storage furniture. And my dad actually made this dressing table for me. So I originally had the Alex 5 drawers down there and I actually needed some more storage for makeup because I literally have too much makeup. It is a joke. I actually bought this counter thing and the legs and also this bit and the mirror all together and made it into a dressing table. But yeah, it's really good for storing makeup. These two here are actually just um, like Alex drawers pretty much. Um, I have all my makeup brushes on here, the setting sprays, candles, I saw clean, that's really good for cleaning your brushes. I've got hand sanitizer, chewing gum, fake flowers on my perfumes. I will move closer up to show my perfumes, have a candle again. I have all my chewy Vivian Redwood, the Tiffany Louis Vuitton, eyelash boxes. And this drawer, I do actually have a lot of false eyelashes, and then on this side, I just have like all my skincare and stuff. But yeah, um, I'll move closer to the perfumes and show you them because I love my perfumes. I love my perfumes so much. I did actually upload a perfume collection a few weeks ago, so if you want to check it out, you can. Also, on my chair is from eBay. The reason why it's blue is because I kind of stained it wearing my black pants, so. The dye must have like it transferred onto the seat and made it a blue but honestly it is a comfiest chair I own in this room actually so it's really good. I think I actually bought it for £40 or so but it's a good bargain. Perfume tray which I love a lot. It's very pretty and has all, all my favourite perfumes on there. So everybody here is the end of my room tour. I really hope that if you guys have enjoyed this video, if you have, make sure to leave a thumbs up, a comment down below, and please subscribe to my channel. And also, don't forget to check out the map before to get your own print of your own personalised, and get a frame of it as well if you want to get a nice frame to be able to match this. It's in the size 50 times 70 centimetres, but yeah, um, it's a really good print and looks perfect in every type of like house or room and everything. Really hope that. You guys have enjoyed this video. If you have, make sure to leave a thumbs up, a comment down below, and please subscribe. And I'll see you all.